Okay, so here we are doing our sensory therapy for the day, making some toffee, my mom's special recipe, and um, we're gonna do an idea session. So there's another Instagram community called Render Weekly, and they do a similar thing to the weekly design challenge where they will you know, just post an idea or a category for people to design. And there's a lot of really cool posts on there. And it's kind of, the, the types of designers are a little bit different because industrial design and just weekly designs in general are, are a little bit different when you start including the word rendering. Rendering is usually a 3D activity. So it's pretty cool. People are throwing awesome ideas up there. Grayson agrees. And today, or this week on Render Weekly, they're doing lighters. And so I am going to do an ideation sesh with lighters. So a lighter, okay, here we go. We're gonna try to come up with, uh, with 20. So I actually, I already have one made, I'll start there. A while ago I was kind of on this steampunk kick, so a, a steampunk style lighter. And then on that note, you could take it and just do a mechanically accurate uh, jet engine, or you could do a truck engine, a car engine, and, and on part of it the, the light comes out. You could do one where there's a, just a different type of um, accelerant that's applied to the lighter. So instead of a red or a blue flame, you could get a purple or a green flame. And I don't know kind of what the, what the health uh, hazards are with that, but at any rate I think it could be pretty cool. Um, I think you put a lighter on the end of a knife or at least in, on the hilt of a knife, so you have just a, a, dual, uh, a dual purpose kitchen item, which I think you could do for anything. You could put a lighter on the end of a wooden stirring stick or you know, like a spatula. Uh, you could put a lighter on, uh, on your car keys. You could put them um, like coming out of the side of your microwave so that if you needed to light like candles, you could just do it there. It's just a button that you push. Um, I think, any, any superhero or anything that has ever, you know, sent out fire, I think that you could, you could get a, uh, what do you call it, a license from, you know, whether it's Fantastic Four or it's uh, Suicide Squad, you just make it so that the flame is coming out of their hands. Uh, you could do like a little Charizard or a Charmander um, fire or really any of the starter Pokemon and have it coming out of their, out of their hands or out of their tails, which I think would be really cool. Um, there's a, I think there's a lot of there's a lot of shapes that you could add to lighters that are not there. I saw somebody post one that looked like like a piece of wood, and it was pretty cool. So I think you make it you know completely out of silicone, and you make it like the Loch Ness monster, or uh, you make it look like any other um, you know animal that's kind of long and lanky. You could make a little giraffe lighter, which I'm sure they have because that sounds awesome. Uh, you could make a lighter that is you know it has like a little face on it and it either comes out of the mouth or it comes out of the eyes and you could just go crazy with that. Any celebrity, you could do custom ones with custom faces uh, because really you would just have to change the outside of the lighter to make it look cool. It would still have the same functionality. Um, on kind of the licensee note, I think that you could do like a pod racer from Star Wars, one of the little engines and make that into a lighter. Uh, I think you could make it look like a little nuclear bomb. You could have one that looks like a space shuttle or a spaceship. Uh, really, any vehicle at all that it's that's coming out of it. And, you know, I'm sure there's plenty of different ways that you could come up with, um, you know, gaps in the market for this. Ooh, my toffee is just about ready. So we're gonna call it there. I'll do the final count when I edit this video. But that's our ideation sesh, me and the scoots, and he's just doing his thing, loving life. I, I do new videos pretty much every day, so subscribe below and hit the little notification bell to stay updated on the videos that me and Grayson make, and we hope to see you again.